What are you doing today? You hear the pitter patter of my little baby's feet. She's feeling a little better today. So I'm so happy about that. I hope everybody's doing very well. I want to thank everybody for being here. I hope that everybody bought something sweet with them. Sorry, I was a couple minutes late. I um wiped off my glasses <laughs> and I made a big mess. So, but that, that's my little girl. She's moving around, which is a good sign. So I'm so happy. I did get her to eat today too. I don't know, is my, can you guys hear me? So I'm not sure. Is everything okay? Cause I was having trouble. You love my hair? Are you able to hear me okay? Nikki, what are you licking? You gotta keep an eye on her. I'm doing good. Thank you, Finn, for showing up. Thank you, everybody. Oh, thank you. Okay, I'm glad you guys could hear me. Yeah, Nikki's here. So did everybody bring something? Look what I bought. This is just, I bought this the other day before Nikki got sick because it's just one of those ones you get at Walmart. Nikki, come here, come here. What do you have? What are you licking? So just one of those ones you bought from Walmart. It said it was strawberry cake, I believe, strawberry icing and strawberry filling. So I'm hoping it is. I'm gonna give you a little close up. It did get a little messed up. I was so careful with this cake when I bought it because I wanted to bring it home and put it in my refrigerator because it's like, it's really small. I don't know how big it looks, but this one actually says till the 16th. So they last for a long time in there. But I was so careful bringing it home and then my son touched it and messed it up. So <laughs> yeah. What did everybody bring? I wanna know. And if you have any questions about Nikki, I'll be more than happy to answer them. Um, I won't be bringing Nikki into the video because she does have a scar from the width of her body from one side all the way to the other. I don't want to show it on here due to the fact that I don't know how strict YouTube is, but I did post a picture of it on my Instagram or Facebook so everybody could see what a huge problem she had. But um, I hope every now obviously I, I put on there my birthday's not till Tuesday, but I started thinking. You know, I think Sunday would probably be a little bit better day to do this with you guys. You know, ooh, coffee and a chocolate bar, I love it. And have a little get together with you guys. She's doing good, she's doing a lot better. We just have to make sure there's no reinfection. They try to get everything out. Um, there's no guarantee, she said. So we have to wash it, doesn't get reinfected some more. But it was bad. Um, she went from lethargic and hardly moving around to really basically almost dying. It just happened so quickly. You brought chips. Oh, your birthday's Tuesday too. A well, happy early birthday, Carmen. Yeah, I thought about doing it Tuesday, but I thought, you know what? I know you guys probably um, can maybe make it here on this day easier than others. And I do have two packages here that were just in my mailbox because I saw Miss Jerry I don't know if she's here, had commented that she had sent a package for my birthday. So I do have that here. Plus there was another one there. So I'm gonna show them both too. I don't know. You guys can kind of see the cake. I'm, I I don't know. The cake is actually crooked. I was thinking it's a camera, but it's a cake. Well, I'm glad you can join. I hope you enjoyed your lunch, Marcella. Am I real? I don't know what that means. <laughs> Let me pinch myself. Yeah, I, I felt that. <laughs> so would you guys like to see the inside of this cake? Oh, thank you. I had a really bad hair day. I was like, you know what? My hair can be so nice sometimes, but as soon as I want to record, no, it doesn't. So don't let me forget about the mail. Would you guys like to see what, it said strawberry. I'll show you exactly what it says. Look here. It smells like strawberry, I have to say that much. So I'm gonna have my little plastic fork here. But yeah, I don't know if, I, I do know my older son is taking me out on my birthday and I uh, love you too. And we'll invite my mom. And um, this is pending, Nikki's doing okay and doesn't have to be at the doctor's office because she obviously comes first. So, but I only saw a few people say what they brought. I hope you guys brought something. I'm ready to try this. I'm actually hungry. So I'm gonna take a piece out of here. Oh, 
What color is the cake, guys? And I hope it has strawberry filling. Ooh. Yeah, I think it does have strawberry filling. Look at here. Look at that. That's what it looks like. Ready? I'm going to take a big bite. Mmm. <laughs> really good you're having fruit rhubarb come rhubarb crumble hmm that sounds interesting it was yeah, like a pink in there yep i have my usual water hey linda thank you so much thank you and thank you everybody for all the well wishes everything you did for nikki you know, it just means so much. And all the thanks, the super thanks that were sent. It was just so nice of all of you very much. Oh, thank you, Emma. We won't discuss how old I'm going to be on Tuesday. You guys can figure it out yourself. <laughs> I'm going to turn this around so you can see it. But it does look like it has strawberry filling. Can you guys see that? But... It's a really small cake. I'd say this is like five inch or something like that. Um, I don't know. Um, but um, it's not really big. I think I paid like $6 for it. I was hoping there's a little bit more. When it had said strawberry filling, it got me at that. <laughs> Oh, her birthday's on night two. We'll tell her happy birthday. Oh, thank you. You are right, Miles. Thank you so much. You had a good guess there. Yep, strawberry. But um, Nikki will be nine this year. She'll be nine years old. I know, that's why I don't... You know, my son, I was like, you don't have to take me out. You don't have to give me nothing. It's like, when you get older, you really don't say you celebrate your birthday quite as much. I mean, it's nice. I'm not embarrassed of my age or anything like that. But they want to do something with me. And, of course, I want to. And I just said, it was just all pending how Nikki's doing. But she seems to be doing really good. Um, the main thing is that she doesn't have more infection come back. Like I said, if they weren't... I'll, I'll explain what happened to her because a lot of people have questions. I started to make a video about the whole thing, but I just didn't do it. Nikki um, has a, everybody I think on here knows that Nikki has um, a lot of skin issues, a lot of allergies. Uh, they say a lot of it tends from her white hair because she's white. And um, she has little tumors on her. She has cysts on her. She has so many skin problems. You've seen how bad her feet got and stuff like that. So she has so many medical problems, but she had. She has several cysts, but one large one was on her back, which they never mess with. They said, we're not going to mess with it. At some point, it will rise up and want to come out and stuff like that. I don't know what happened what happened, and what caused it to get so big and so fast, you know, so bad that Wednesday that I called and I said, I need to bring her in for an emergency. Or I need to bring her in for an appointment. They didn't have anything, so they did an emergency one. But... It just happened so quick, and when I took her in, they said, yeah, well, the cyst is coming up. She was running a fever. She was very lethargic. She wouldn't move. As a matter of fact, when I drove her here, to show you how sick she is, you guys know, she's scared to death to be in a car, and she cries, and she cries, and she cries. She didn't even have enough energy to cry. And when I got her there, they took her back there, and they put her on IV, and gave her antibiotics, and gave her steroids, and gave her three different medicines to come home with, and... After that, they also injected fluid. I think, my understanding, don't quote me on anything, but my understanding is they injected fluid under the cyst to help bring the fluid up. Well, the next day, I could tell she was still running a fever, which I knew she was before because she was shivering a lot. And she's a hot mama. <laughs> she's hot like her mama. And um, she was running a fever. And I noticed it was a little bit more swollen, but I thought, okay, they just did all this stuff. They manipulated it. They angered it some and stuff like that. And then when I, when I and she was always like whimpering in the night because she was in pain, but she was on pain medicine. 
but I don't think we really, nobody realized how bad it was. And um, when I woke up that Friday and I looked at it, I thought, oh my gosh, there's something obviously the matter. She was hot to touch. She was so hot with a high fever. I couldn't even touch near her back. She literally, she didn't snap at me, but she acted like she wanted to because she didn't want you anywhere near her back. So I picked her, I called him, I said, she's not feeling good, I need to bring her in. I picked her up, I took her in there, and we went into the, you go into the doc, you know, they have rooms, you go into the room, we went into the room, the nurse came in and she saw it, she goes, I, I'm gonna take Nikki with me and I'll be right back. And she took her with her, which I thought was very odd because, um, the doctor always just came to the room and stuff like that and took care of her. And the doctor came back and she goes, it's bad. She's bad. She said, which I know what the word means, but I cannot say it. But I think it's necrosis. I don't know if I'm saying that correctly, but you know the word. I'm not going to get into food de full details, but you guys know. They said, in which I thought at first it was just a big scab, but I'm not a doctor. I didn't know. And that's what it looked like, but it was eaten away at her. And she says, I'm, she said, today's Friday. I really don't want to have to do surgery on Friday because I'm not going to be available because they're just a vet office. They run a hospital. They said, we won't be available. So I'm going to go take her to the back. Man, I just, I'm sorry. I just got dizzy. Hmm. But, um, they said, I, she said, I have to check her out. This was a different doctor. She goes, I need to check her out and see how bad it is. She goes, but it looks really bad. She says, if I have to, I'll stay here till midnight. I don't care. I'll do her surgery. But she said, if there was a chance that it would be okay, I don't want to do it till Monday so that I could be here and available if it gets worse or has any problems. And so she took Nikki to the back and she came back almost immediately and she goes please come see this and I went to see it all kinds of blood and pus and well you know what all kinds of nasty stuff comes out of a cyst all kinds of stuff and she said it is deep it is badly infected and they don't know how much they will have to cut away of the dead skin and tissue and stuff like that she said it needs to be done right away and I said absolutely whatever it is you know to help my little girl we will do and they took her back right away and did surgery, basically. And it took quite a long time because she said it was so bad, so badly infected, and it was so deep. And then they had to cut off all the dead tissue and skin and re-put it back. But if you look on my Instagram or my Facebook, I did post a picture so you guys could see. I mean, it's like this long. It's the width of her back. Not the length, but the width. So bad, so horrible. I don't think so. She just has severe allergies. So they once again sent me home for, with, um, and she obviously had lots of fluids, lots of, she had steroid shots, antibiotic shot, and she they sent me home with more antibiotics, more steroids, and more pain medicine, because the other ones they said was not um, responding. It was not working for her, so but that's how bad it quickly got overnight. And doctor said, had I not brought her in that Friday, she don't know what would have happened to Nikki over the weekend. She could have ended up with a big gaping hole, eat, bigger than what she had eaten away. She could have passed. They don't know. They are very nice, yeah. But for it to go, and I guess it went so bad so quickly because the antibiotics and that just didn't respond to it. I'll let you see this. I don't know if you can see it. You can see some of it. That's the inside. But at this point, she seems to be doing good. Obviously, it doesn't look pretty to me, but to a doctor, it might not look bad. You know how you are. It looks horrible to me. They did put in... Um, dissolvable stitches because it was from the inside all the way out and so they did that so she won't have to have stitches removed and she has to keep being rechecked but i'm hoping that you know the only other thing that really bothers me all well, two things was that she said 
hey Betty Boo, how are you? She said they tried to get everything out, they couldn't guarantee it. There's never a guarantee that they could get everything out, but they can't guarantee it won't come back neither, which means when you have like cyst, if, if something was maybe left in or some kind of little, I don't know, it can come back, which bothers me, but she has a lot of cysts, so I hope this doesn't happen again. <clears throat> me too, yeah, I'm so glad. And when I picked her up, she was so happy to see me. She was, you know, anesthetic and all that, still groggy now, but she's so happy to see me. She gave me kisses on my arm when I was carrying her. I said, thank you so much, because I was carrying her out to the car and stuff. I said, thank you so much. She gave me lovings. Made me feel a little bit better, because I thought, oh, poor thing, because she don't understand, you know. Hey, Jessica. Hey, Mardivo. <clears throat> Sorry, <laughs> a little piece of cake went down the wrong way. But, yeah, it was horrible. But I'm happy now. I did get her to eat, which is a good thing. Today would be the first day she really started eating. Um, have a hard time giving her pills, whether she's sick or not. When she was with all her high fever and all that sickness, she was still spitting out her medicine. She was being a stinker. Yeah, I, I think it was because the medicines didn't work that it just got like this horrible. I'm not a vet. I don't know. Um, but it could have been a um, horrible outcome. I mean, it was a horrible outcome, but it, but it could have been much worse. And I just appreciate all the love and concern you guys had for her. She's lucky. And like I said, I'm not, she is moving around. I'm not going to pick her up because it does bother her some. But I also don't want to bring it here on YouTube. And, um, because I don't know what they think. I mean, it is a pretty big score. And then she got shaved on her arm also because of all the IVs and stuff like that, which that's not a big thing. But I did post a picture on my Instagram and my Facebook. So if you'd like to see how huge the scar was, it was not only huge, it was very deep, way down there. But her being healthy and safe is the best birthday present I could ever ask for, right? Oh, thank you, I'm glad you at least are here. Maybe you don't understand what I'm saying, but I'm glad you're at least here. Sorry, my chat disappears so quick. Yeah, she seems to be doing good. She needs lots of rest, lots of fluids. She's still stubborn. She still has that stubbornness in here. Thank you, Patty. Thank you for all the early birthdays, guys. I just figured to, Sunday was better than Tuesday because a lot of you might be off or and be home and be able to chat and join me. You know, it's hard. I was thinking today, I'm sure... My husband, he always bought me flowers and he always got me a special card and he always took me out to dinner. And I was just thinking what he would have done this year, right? I know last year he wasn't here neither and I didn't even, I don't, did I? Hmm. I don't know if I, every year I normally come on here around my birthday time and have a cake with you or something like that. I don't know, did I do it last year or not? I don't remember. Oh, oh, thank you for my flowers. <laughs> I appreciate it. But it's really good cake for just being a little Walmart brand cake, guys. It's not bad. Like I said, I think it looks big. It's not teeny tiny. I mean, it's like a five inch. It doesn't say on there, but I'd say this is about a five inch round cake. I don't know. It is good. <laughs> Happy birthday, boy. <laughs> so, but I hope everybody's having a great weekend. I hate wearing my glasses so much because it just shows the glare. Oh, thank you. I wish we could sing happy birthday, but you can't even do that on YouTube. <laughs> but Nikki says, thank you for all the well wishes, right, Nikki? She's just looking at me. She's still very tired and resting a lot. And Oh, thank you, Sarah. Thank you. Thank you, guys. And she, um, I, I, like, I don't let her go out the doggy door because there's a flap 
and I don't want it to rub on her back. So I told her, no, you got to go through the door. <laughs> but sometimes she doesn't listen or she sneaks up and goes through there. And I don't think it'll hurt her, but I just know the flap, um, you know, there's wind blowing, dirt blowing. But I'm so happy she's feeling good. So just keeping an eye on her. She is honestly like my own child. I love her that much that she is like my own child. <laughs> you know, and I had such wonderful comments and stuff like that. But one comment, somebody said, I deleted it because I thought it was so rude. And I usually try not to. It, I mean, sometimes my moderators do. And that's fine because that's what they're there for. But I don't always try to. But this, you know, this person said, "Come, well, it's not the end of the world, whoa. She means a lot to me. It would be just like devastating to me if something happened to her. But I don't know why people would say stuff like that. You know, I don't know. Maybe it's, to me it was rude. Mm, thank you. So. But. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I, I didn't get to see all the, the coronation, but I got to watch a little bit of it. Did you watch it on TV? I didn't get to see because you're thinking, did you watch it on TV or were you able to go there? <laughs> the icing is very rich. I'd rather just eat the cake. I have so many favorites, but I, I'm the type of person it depends on the mood I'm in. I do listen to other ones, but it, sometimes I might listen to some that I've never heard before. But if like if I'm in the mood for scratching, I go, I put that in there, go towards that or this. But I do have some of my favorites. I mean, there's just so many wonderful, wonderful ones out there. There really is. Sorry, I'm doing my AC, <laughs> but yeah, I have so many that I do watch though, but. And I watch non-ASMR too. Now I can imagine Betty, Betty Boo, like Klondike ice cream, that is good ice cream. What would you do for a Klondike bar? <laughs> um, I think these are right on Amazon. They're just, it's just cover-ups, just a cover-up to go over top. So I believe you just put in cover-up over Amazon. It wasn't a Mel video, I think, this, though. But I do believe it's right off of Amazon. Thank you, Angie. Are you all recuperated from your vacation, Angie? Oh, thank you. I was looking at this because like I said I bought this actually right before the week that Nikki got sick but right before she got sick and I was looking at pieces of cake because that's all I really needed was a piece of cake that real pretty peanut butter one but it was going out of date much sooner and I looked around and a lot of stuff were because I was buying it ahead of time and then I saw this and I thought okay I'll just do that one I like strawberry <laughs> no problems and whenever I don't eat my son comes over here you know, I'm not, I'm not a big, like, this is kind of a little too sweet with all this icing, but let me take some of it off, but I prefer just the cake part, but I'm more of like a savory kind of person. You guys know that. I like the savory stuff. <laughs> but yeah, another year. My older sister is coming this next week because she's going on a cruise um that is my oldest oldest son and this other one hold on i'm gonna pick you up that is my youngest son the top one is my youngest and this lower one is my oldest son he has on a little nasa suit here and on this one i always told him he was striking a pose but he was literally he just stopped crying just for those few seconds because he was crying. He was pissed. 
and he was falling over and his hands just jerk like that because <laughs> I was holding him from behind, which you do. And <clears throat> <coughs> sorry, I'm, you guys know, <clears throat> <coughs> I have trouble swallowing. I'm sorry. Um, well, no, probably not. <laughs> They don't really want to be in it. I think I did feature my older son once or twice. My younger son don't want to be in it at all. But you have seen his arms in there because when I did the ASMR, one of the massages on the arms, it was my son's arm. So, but yeah. Looks so good, doesn't it? <laughs> YouTube isn't for everybody, you know? A lot of people don't want to be on it. And I understand. I don't, I don't even want to always be on it. Because <laughs> I think I look terrible half the time, but I do it because I love you guys. I'm actually a very shy person. I do not, I do not like to have my picture taken or to be on video, believe it or not. I don't do it. But here I am making YouTube videos, you know? I would say if you're going to start any kind of channel, be, um, oh, what word do I want to use? Consistent. Consistency is important. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, CJ. It's a strawberry cake, Mardiva. Really good. It is really good, actually. I could have made one. I actually thought about that. And I'm glad I didn't buy this stuff because I would have never had time probably to make it. But, um, I mean, I might have. But I was going to do a strawberry cake. So, and I thought, by the time I get the cake mix, get the icing, get the fresh strawberries, and do all that stuff, I could just buy this. And, oh, thank you so much, Tease tease here thank you so much for the super chat that's so kind of you but um and i thought by the time i do all that it's going to end up costing a lot of money too uh, yes i live in the united states and i was born here correct but that's so sweet of you to send that but i figure oh, this is easier <laughs> Thank you for the happy birthday to these. I think it's these. I think so. Yes, I do, Marcella. I love to paint. As a matter of fact, I started putting, I put two on my Etsy store. One sold, but the other one's still sitting there. Then I'm thinking about doing a relaxed one and putting it out there too. So I love doing junk journals. It's just relaxing. And sometimes it gets a little stressful. Thank you, Kristen. Sometimes it gets a little stressful when I do the junk journals. Because even though they're so imperfect, I want them perfect. Does that make sense? I want to do a good job. I want to make sure they're really nice. Hey, Queen Bee. And I love them to be imperfect and irregular, but I still need them to be perfect in the way I want them, if that makes sense. Thank you, Robin. I know. Can you believe it? What are we at? Let's see. Boy, it's getting hot in here. I'm going to readjust my AC again. Girl gets hot sitting here talking to you guys. Um, what am I at? Let me see. Yeah, I'm at one. It, mine says 189,450. <laughs> Crazy, huh? So excited. I was hoping we'd make it to two. Thank you, Tara. I was hoping we'd make it to 200,000 for my birthday. We didn't do that, but we did good. Proud of you guys for pushing it. I know. Can you imagine that, Doug Mara? I remember when I got my first subscriber, and then I was so excited when I made it to 100. And I thought, man, there's no way I'm going to make it to 1,000. And I made it to 1,000. It was just so nice. Oh, thank you, Dagmira. Dag, Dag, Dagmira. I, hope, I'm, I know I'm probably not saying that. Oh, thank you, Carice. I haven't seen you in a long time. How are you doing? So... But I also have two packages here I'd like to open. Maybe we'll get back to the cake. I gotta stop for a little bit. This is sweet as heck. 
delicious though. Look at that. <laughs> we'll set it to the side over here. I have my phone here too. My mom, I swear she's so funny. I'll tell her, mom, I'm going to go live. If it's an emergency, you call me no matter what. I said, but I'm going to go live and I'll call you when I get done. But she'll still call sometimes because <laughs> she forgets. But still, I'm going to set this down for just a minute. Set it aside. I also actually brought my junk journal. If you guys would like to see part of it, I might do a video on it. I'm not sure, but I do have one left in my Etsy store. One just sold today, a little one. I'm working on more. I'm always busy, busy, busy working on those. But if you'd like to see it, I have it here too. I always bring it because sometimes people ask me about it and want to see it. So I brought me some wipes. So I keep my hands nice and clean. But I didn't bring anything to throw it in though. I'll use that. Okay. So this, I wish, is Jerry here? Jerry, are you here? She told me she sent this and it did come in the mail. Well, I'm glad you made it. I'm glad you made it today. Oh, Queen V, lots of love to you, Christine. Happy birthday and congrats on 109,000. You're beautiful and resilient. And oh, thank you. That is so sweet to say, Queen V. Thank you. Thank you for this super chat so much. That is such a sweet thing to say. I don't feel resilient a lot of times. As you guys know, I started therapy, and I'm so glad I did. I really am so glad I started therapy. Because um, like I said before, I'm not in any way embarrassed to say I go to therapy. I've told you guys from the beginning, I suffer depression and anxiety, anxiety really bad. And I always have since I was a young girl. So I'm not embarrassed to say it, but I, you know, when I think it's, now that I'm older and all this has happened, it's a little different. And there's just certain things I feel I can't say to my family or discuss with my family that I could say to her I see a female that I could say to her and stuff like that. But, oh yes, let's go. Thank you, Queen V. But um, I, I'm happy I'm started it and I could tell her some stuff. It's gonna be a process of working through things, you know? And I told you, I started a list of words of how I feel and we talked about those. I, I could tell you some of the words that I put down. I, it, and this is how I feel. So, you know, this is just how I felt for a while. And, um, cause she, had, we had talked and we were saying stuff and I was just telling her how, you know, how I was feeling. And we were talking about describing myself, you know, and I feel, I'm, I'll go over it another time. I, this is a birthday one, we won't do it today, but, but it is, it is a struggle, you're right. And I do believe, is this not um, the month for, Um, I don't know. Oh, thank you, Miles. But I do think this is a month for depression, is it not? So it's good to always get the word out there. So this is from Jerry. I don't think mental health. Thank you, because I couldn't think of the word, Angie. Thank you so much. It is Mental Health Awareness Month, I believe. Don't ever be embarrassed. If you feel like you need to talk to somebody, go do it. Whether it's a therapist or even somebody that you trust, you know, but I, I just found a therapist is easier because there's certain things that I feel I didn't want to say to my family, you know, that I felt comfortable saying to her because she is basically a stranger to me that I didn't, she doesn't know everything that went on and can't judge really, you know, or anything like that. But I wish Jerry was here. This is from Jerry Fortune. Check out her channel. She sent me this and I do have a box. I don't know who the box is from, but this just came in my mail and I thought I'd do it on this video. She did say this was for my birthday. So I'm glad that I got it. I ran up to the post office real quick and got it. And then that other one was with it. So we're gonna open this. I can't let you see the front because it has her address on there. But I don't, know, I don't think that's a card. I think that's just a, let me see. But yeah, so a package like this. It has stuff in there. Show you this part. I don't know what's in there because I'm just opening it with you guys. So and I don't know if this is a card here. I don't think so. I think it's just a thing that says my address. And actually, I crossed off her address some, but I think this is just a a note she put with my address. I just want to be sure it's not a card in there. No, yeah. Okay, it's just that. <laughs> so this is what's in there, so I can show it to you because it's out now. 
Look at here, I don't know what's in there, so we're gonna take a peek. So here's the first thing. Oh, be bouncy skin. Animated beer face mask. Isn't that so cute, guys? Are you okay? Are you okay? Do you need something? You have a nightmare, maybe? Something scare you? It's okay, there's nothing going on. Lay down, baby. Lay down. Lay down my mama. I think I heard a little bit of pow pow. I don't know if it's fireworks or something like that. You know how she gets, so. But look at that. And here's the back. Oh, it says watermelon infused with hydrating watermelon. Look at that, guys. That looks like fun. I could use some. I could use a lot of stuff. <laughs> so we have, oh, oh my gosh. Look at here, guys. Look at this right here. These are some pens and they are froggies. Oh my gosh. Oh, Jerry. I hope you see this video. Look at here, guys. I'm gonna have to go back and put mail in here too so they know to look. Look at that. Oh, are they different colors? Let me see. Oh no, they have little caps on them. I'm like, what is that? <laughs> little cap, but I don't know if it's little froggies on there. So cute. It's Jerry Fortune and she does have a YouTube channel. Isn't that so cute and adorable? My little girl's nervous. I hate for her to be nervous. <laughs> You're funny, Miles. You have these pens? Aren't they so cute and adorable? That's so sweet. I love them. So cute. If you, I sure most of you know that I collect frogs. I have so much frog stuff around here, it's crazy. I'm crazy, so what can I say, right? They're so cute and adorable. I'm sorry, I keep feeling dizzy, guys. Oh, look, oh, look at here. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> it's a scrunchie that lights up. How adorable is that? They're so cute. I didn't know, so I'm like, what is that? They're so cute. Oh, different. And then solid, so. Off, fast, slow, solid. That Yeah, that would be perfect. Beautiful color. Look at that. That would probably be some great ASMR sounds. So, that is so cute. So adorable. Here is love. Oh, my gosh, my eyes are bad. Oh, it's a mascara. Mascara. Let me see if I can open this up. I don't have any of my tools here. It's pretty soft. Oh, I'm sorry, little girl. Are you okay? Lay down. It's okay, baby. I might be able to bring her up later, but I'm not going to show her owies. Yep, there we go. That's interesting. Look how cute that is. Oh, wow. Listen. Oh, wow. That looks pretty neat. That looks like it has a lot of little things on there to really get your lashes going there. That's nice. Let's see what this is. Oh, this is, says Rare Platinum Intense. So that's a little perfume sample. So cute, so adorable, isn't that? Oh, that's so nice. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. Let me see. Wow. Look at the color on there. Wow. That's red. A little lipstick there. I'm going to wipe it on my finger here. <laughs> I think that's, that's lipstick, right? It's not like a... Because I know they do eyeshadows like this now, too, you guys. Oh, there's a little note from Jerry. I'm going to open that up, too. Let me see. There's something else in there. Oh, another little lipsticks. Let's see what color this is. I'm... Oh, that's a nice color too. Oh, I like that because that's not quite as dark. Look here. That's actually a really pretty color too. I mean, the other one's pretty too. So cute. You know what this would be cute for? My little mannequin head. That's a perfect size for her lips. <laughs> then I have a clinical 
intense pill. So cute, so adorable. Then we have Core Strawberry, sorry. It's a lip balm, but it says strawberry, strawberry. That's always good here in Florida. Well, anywhere really, but definitely good here in Florida because my lips get chapped all the time. What's the matter, baby? What's the matter? Then this is, I'm not sure, looks like a keychain. It says micro urban mill keychains. That. I'm gonna cut that open. And I see a little note here. I'm not sure what that does. <laughs> I'm not sure what that is. Oh, I think that's like a little, you guys think that's a little, that's actually so neat. It looks like it would be kind of, you know, sealed really good. Do you think that's a pill container? I can't read all the small writing. It doesn't say, but I think that, what do you guys think? Do you think that'd be like a, a pill container? Yes, thank you, everybody. Everybody, thank you. Hi, hi, can we get the likes? What do you guys think? I think that's a little pill container. Jerry might be able to tell us down in the comment section. So that's pretty neat. Nikki's looking. You want to see? No, okay. And then it says, from the paws of, I found these pens and thought of you. Here are some other items for you. The hair tie lights up, Jerry and Dan. Look at there, so cute, look at that, look at that. So cute, isn't that so adorable, guys? Isn't that so sweet? Thank you so much, Jerry. I got a little note to make sure she comes on here and checks out this video. So many cute things, those pens, I mean, it's adorable. And those lipsticks, I mean, I might use them on me too in a video, but that's perfect for my little mannequin head. <laughs> I think they'd go perfect on there, don't you guys think? I wonder how, oh, that does smell good. Very nice, very cute. I'm just gonna put the stuff in here so I have it in here. Thank you so much, Jerry and Dan. That is so sweet of you. And then I have, I've been more and more dizzy lately. I am, I, I just had a lot of blood work done and I do know my iron is really bad. So that might be another definite cause, which I'm sure it doesn't help. And my, Ferritin was only four. So no wonder I'm so freaking dizzy all the time, but I don't know why I'm having all this sensation. So they, or she wants to send me to a neurologist, but she had to get the blood work first. But maybe it all has to do with my anemic and iron deficiency. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I just am continually dizzy. Sometimes worse than others. Or I can have a couple days that I don't have nothing, you know. I don't think I showed you the box. And I can show it to you because there's no uh, address on here. Let's do a little little tap in for you. Let's do tap. That's lipstick. And I noticed I've been bruising really easy too, which is a big sign too. Yeah, so I, I only got just the test results yesterday, which you say, well, that's on a Christine, but I could log into the lab that does it. Once my doctor reads them, they're allowed to post it on the lab website, and then I can go in there and, and look at it myself. But of course, I have to wait to see what my doctor says. She makes the decision. <sighs> yeah, I've been anemic and iron deficient. And a lot of people try to tell me it's the same thing. It's not the same thing. I have both of them. And um, I mean, if they don't believe me, they could ask their own hematologist. It's not the same thing. But I've had them both, but with my ferritin being so low, that means I have no backup. Once my iron's depleted, there's, you know, it goes over there and it helps pull it over to give you some iron, but there's nothing there, obviously. So, you guys ready? I'm so excited, as usual. Oh, and it came in a, ooh, it came in a bag. You have both, too. Do a lot of people try to tell you that, too, that, oh, it's the same thing? It's, it's not, though. If you can be anemic and iron deficient. So, oh, you have them both, too, Vanessa? Wow, so you guys know what it feels like. I mean, I used to have iron infusions all the time. But see, they would never, my hematologist told me, 
there's probably about three, well, at that time, this was years ago, there's probably about 3% of people that they'll never know why they're like that because I had a hysterectomy, so I don't have that problem. I've been checked top and bottom, no problem. You know, they can't figure out why. They have talked about doing a bone marrow biopsy. See me, I keep getting dizzy. Uh, bone marrow biopsy, but um, we haven't done that. So I don't know, should I look at the card first or the gift first? But it says keep it a surprise, so we'll maybe keep it a surprise. Are you guys ready? Oh, look at this. Look at that. Thank you. Uh, look at the colors on here, guys. Is that not amazing? These bags. I love these bags. So, you spelled it right. It's best just to Google it and look it up because I'm not a medical doctor and I don't want to give out the... But it helps. It's It um, helps with... Your, it's part has to do with your iron and stuff. Isn't it super cute? I wasn't this dizzy earlier. That's what my problem is. Sometimes it just, <laughs> it just happens, you know. Okay, I'm going to let you guys peek first. You want to, oh, it looks like it's wrapped in paper. But there we go. Ready, guys? Oh, thank you for the birthday wishes. I love these bags. This card here will say the same thing as this right here. So we'll get back to that in just a minute. Oh my gosh, look. <laughs> I know you guys can't really see it. Let me take it out. It's so freaking cute. Guess what it is. What do you guys think it is? I'm just curious. What do you think this is? Well, not what it is, but what type animal or, I, don't, I guess this is, or frog's an animal. I don't know, but it's so cute. Look at that. What's the matter? You want to come say hi? You want to come say hi to everybody? Okay, let me show them this. Then we'll bring you up here to say hi, okay? Because they were asking about you. Let me say hi to that beautiful little girl. Look at guys. Oh, thank you so much, Queen V. It does say Queen Bee, but it's kind of covered. Oh, wait. Shoot. Was that... Who was the last Super Chat? I'm sorry. Was that... I don't know why my phone... Is, something's acting up. Was that... Who was on the last Super Chat? Oh, thank you. I'm not getting older. You're getting better. I like that. Who was that? It looked like it was Queen Bee, but I wasn't sure. Because I want to be sure I say thank you to the right person. Isn't that so cute? Can one of my moderators tell me, please? Because it will not. I don't know why this is giving me such a hard time. Okay, thank you, Queen V. Thank you. Because some reason, I don't know if it's showing up on you guys. But it was blocked part of the way. Thank you, Dream. Isn't that cute? So cute, and then this sets right in here. That's so cute and adorable. Let's see who that's from. I am going to set this over here. And like I said, we'll, we'll, I'll show you the card. Oh, that's small writing. It's from Jillian. You are such a joy and light. Thank you for all that you do to make others feel loved and included. I hope you enjoy this and able to make wonderful sounds. XOXO. Oh, Jillian, dream of Rivia. Riv Rivera. I think I said that right. Am I saying that right, Jillian? Oh, thank you. Look at <laughs> That is so sweet of you. Thank you so much. I'm going to show you guys this one too so you can see it says the same thing. Dream of Rivera. I think I say that right. I hope so. Oh, that's so sweet of you. Thank you so much. Look at here, guys. Isn't that so sweet? That's so cute. It looks like Nikki wants to come up here and say hi to you guys. Come here, baby. Come here. Come on. You want to come say hi? 
Give me a second, guys. Let me gently pick her up. Come here. Come over here. Come here. I'm going to just try to be careful. Easy. Hold on. Give me a second, guys. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Let me try to get her up. Oh, oh I don't want to show this on here, though. It's not nice to see. Oh, I know, baby. I know. Here she is, guys. Here's my little girl. And then she had to have her arm shaved over here. I don't know if you can see here. It's shaved for her IVs. Oh, everybody says hi. They say you look beautiful. And she does. And they shaved her back. There's Nikki. Say hi. You want to see mommy's frog she got? Look at here. She's sniffing it. That's a frog. You see the froggy? Oh, what do you think of that frog? This a pretty little frog, huh? Oh, it says, we love you, Miss Nikki. Lots of hearts and doggies. Oh, sweet baby. Yeah, she's been through a lot, guys. She says, hi, Nikki. They say, hi. Say, hi. Say, guys, I do better. She, I do better. She does look better, yeah. She literally couldn't even move. And now she's moving around. I would show you guys, but I just think YouTube would frown against it because just to show you how fast and it's really more to show you like it could go from like this to this, you know, it got enraged and got bad quickly, but check out my Instagram. Oh, I love her so much, guys. You want to go up a little higher? Okay, there you go. Say hi, everybody. She still has fever, though. I can tell she still has fever. <laughs> Am I talk? You don't want me to talk about it? Huh? Do you not want me to talk about it? Huh? Aren't you just a sweet girl? You s oh, are you smelling the cake over there? No, ma'am. You can't have that. No human food. She could have no human food, guys. Because of her allergies so bad. Yeah. They said the stitches are like... Um, uh, dissolve, dissolve. So she does look better. Yesterday she didn't look that good, but it was an improvement. And today she looks better. I just don't want to get infected being very careful. See, she's very sensitive. I can't even, I, I didn't even really touch near it. She squinched a little bit on her back. So I, I'm assuming it's still very sore. I mean, it was a deep, they said it was deep. I don't know what word they use. I almost used crevice, but it's not really crevice, but a deep hole that she had. So, but I love her so much, you know, and somebody was saying, well, you know, it's not the end of the world. Well, it's, I didn't say it was the end of the world, you know. It would just be devastating to me to lose her. I, she really did. If it wasn't for her, I would have never got out of bed when my husband passed away. I mean, my kids, I love them so much, but they were able to take care of myself. She couldn't take care of herself, and it wasn't for her being here, giving me all the love and everything else. I probably, I wouldn't have got out of bed for I don't know how long, you know. Well, there was a bird, huh? I wouldn't have got out of bed. She needed me. I needed her. She gave me love. She still does. She always did. She's so loving. You can... <laughs> can go out the door for two minutes and come back and she will love on you like she haven't seen you for a year. Yeah, it is very scary and how fast it it happened. I, you know, it happened so quick. There was none on Wednesday because she was at the doctor's office and then come Friday, it already started eating deep to, on top and deep and inside. It was It was horrible. That's how quick. And I really think... when they manipulated it, obviously I don't think, I in no way find anybody wrong. I'm just expressing how I feel. I think when it got manipulated by the doctor, it just aggravated it so bad and it went crazy. Besides the fact of um, the antibiotics not working and everything else because it was not help. The antibiotics were, I don't know the words she used, but they were not, it was not responding to those antibiotics whatsoever. So it was like having none. I was giving her some, but it was like having none, you know. But she is a true blessing to me. Mm, that's from everybody. I gave her one from all of you. 
forget a big old smooch, but she has so many skin problems and allergies and, you know, it's a lot. It really is. And I honestly didn't even care how much the surgery cost. She was going to, I was going to do whatever I could to save her. So. Right, little girl? Just my best buddy. It was my husband's best buddy, but now she's my best buddy. I inherited her. I mean, she loved me a lot, too. She loved me a lot, too. But her and my husband were like this. Thank you for 100 likes. Let's see how much higher we could get it, guys. Thank you so much. So, she was sick. I, I talked about it earlier and, and I stuff like that. I don't want to keep repeating it because I probably bore everybody. But she was sick. But she's doing a little bit better now. Well, she's doing a lot better now. But this doesn't look all that great. So, I mean, it, it, it just doesn't look good because it's a big scar with stitches. But, I mean, it doesn't look infected. And I'm hoping, what I'm worried about is what's inside. That everything is looking good inside, which I can't see. But I could tell she still has a fever. She still feels warm. When she, Wednesday and Thursday and Friday, she had a high fever. And I could just tell by touching her, she was so, are you going to CPC in your mama's arms? <laughs> she had a high fever and just wasn't feeling good. I mean, literally, she wouldn't get up. She wouldn't even get out of bed. I picked her up. I knew that she was hurting, so. Well, thank you, Lauren. I think she's so cute, too. She's spoiled rotten. This girl's spoiled rotten. Right, little girl? And her ears started getting real red, too. And they said that was from allergies again. So she did get another allergy shot. Poor girl, everything she went through, they still give her allergy shot because a lot of the stems, all her skin issues stem from allergies and stuff like that her name is nikki or kiki in the video she's called kiki kardashian <laughs> right little girl she's just resting she just must have wanted mama she still don't feel good obviously i mean she had major surgery she just needs her mama's lovings right little girl Here we just hi, but those such cute gifts. I just love everything. Thank you, Jillian, Jerry, and Dan. Such cute and adorable stuff. Nikki liked it all too, but she was sniffing at that cake. She was like, I want a piece of that cake. Uh, she's not getting none. I'm gonna have another couple bites with you guys, but yeah. She always demands, well, she hasn't the last few nights. But when she was feeling good, every night she demands her belly gets tickled. <laughs> I told her, when's you gonna start tickling my belly? You know, but the last few nights she comes to bed, I bring her to bed, I lay her down, I cover her up and she goes to sleep. She's just exhausted, you know. She ate good today. She ate really good today. I was very happy. She ate a little bit yesterday, which I was fine with, that she at least had something in her belly and she drank. I'm trying to make sure she has really cool water, nice cool water. For her and making sure she drinks oh thank you big bold beauty with the big heart i'm sure that was for nikki thank you so much for your super chat i don't know if those are called super chats or super things but <laughs> thank you <laughs> but yeah she's my bubby girl huh but i oh i'm gonna show you the junk drone you ready mm. see Say hi to everybody. Say hi to everybody. We'll bring her up maybe later. Oh. Mm. Mm. She gets mad when I give her too much love. It's too. Okay, ready? I'm going to do easy, 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 easy. Okay, go lay on the AC. She likes to lay by the AC because where it comes up through the floor, it gets nice and cool there. So I want to show you the junk journal that's in my Etsy store right now. I have one left. I'm working on more. Aw, oh, thank you, Big Bull Beauty. Thank you, Nicole. She's, she's, what? What? Do you want back up? Huh? Or you want to lay down? Let me show them this and I'll bring it back in a minute, okay? If you want to. But I have this one in my Etsy store. I just want to show you. But you want to look at that bag? You don't need to look at that bag, do you? She's no, I think she's nosy. <laughs> she also hears the crinkling of the bag and she thinks it might be something for her. But with this junk journal, you get this cute little pen with that. I love, I love these. <laughs> I am obsessed with these pens. Look at that. 
I am so obsessed with these pens. Believe it or not, I'm gonna pull you guys closer. Come a little closer. Don't look at me too close though, because I'm a mess. Oh, that's okay, Lauren. Yeah, she definitely looks better. More alert, yeah. Here's the side of it. It's got a little, just little frilly little things on the side. I'm not gonna go through all through it. I'm just gonna show you the general of it. I have pictures posted on my Instagram. If you're not on my Instagram or Facebook, where are you? You gotta sign up for them. On my Instagram and Facebook, I post when I put journals up. I post all my videos coming up. Everything you're missing out on a lot. I love all the little frillies here. Have this cute, now she's, she's uh, digging the carpet. <laughs> but I put this on it. I think I called it fluttering heart. I think so because the butterfly is fluttering. But look at all the frillies in there. I love all this that hangs out the top. I know, don't you just love these? And it's come, I don't know how well these refills work, but it did come with the refill, so I stuck it in too. Oh, thank you, Nubby. <laughs> thank you, oh. I don't know why my super chats are being covered. Guys, help me with who's doing the super chats for some reason. Oh, I don't understand why this is doing this to me. I saw Nubby and I can't see the other one. Can somebody help me, please? Darn. You see, it begins with the F. And I'm doing it to do in review. Or is it just... Oh, Big Bull Beauty. Thank you so much. I don't know why it's doing that to me. Thank you again, Big Bull Beauty. That's so sweet. And I swear I saw Nubby. Was there a Nubby there too, Angie? I certainly don't want to miss out on somebody that's so kind to do that. But thank you, Big Bull Beauty. You're so sweet. But yeah, look at... And Nubby. Thank you, Nubby. Thank you, everybody. I am so sorry. I don't know why it's doing it. My thing is messing up and I hate that because I definitely you know appreciate everything that you guys do it's so sweet of you so and it says fingers ASMR Nikki I'm watching you from the Philippines is that what that says on that one Angie darn you I don't understand I think it says fingers ASMR or no yeah thank you fingers Thank you so much. I don't know why that's messing up like that. That is really odd that that's doing it. Never did that before. Or is it is it fingers ASMR or is it... I'm sorry, Angie, to put all that on you. Okay, okay. It's, it's showing... What it's showing is it's showing the super chat, then two, two chats on top of it, so I can't see it. I'm not sure how to say the name, so... Fifi? Fifi? I'm not sure. I hope I said that right. Thank you so much for your super chat. Thank you. But when it's doing a super chat, it's showing two chats on top of it, and I can't see it. I never had that before. So I'm just going to give you a little glimpse inside, guys, so you can see. What do you see the inside, how I did that? Look at here. Look at this. Is that not so pretty? Fluttering heart in my Etsy store, but it has such cute and adorable pages, and we're just going to skim through it really quick, the little flips. I'll try to maybe do a video on it because I know you guys like it, but I, I don't make any promises because these junk journals sometimes sell so quickly I don't get to do a video on them. But yeah, little pockets, all kinds of cuteness. Of course, I make homemade tags. This is one side of the tag. Here's the other. I love that tag. I love it with that on there. Do you guys like that? Oh, are you feeling good? She's feeling good right now, guys. She had food right before we came on. Here she comes. But look at that, it's so cute, so adorable, love. You got the little tags in there. I made another little tag. I like this little flip here too. It's on this page, it flips open. You got so much cuteness. It's hard to show it on here because I have to hold it up. But so cute, so adorable, little crinkly pages. You have little heart and I love this right here. Look guys, little, just a little bookmark for you. But I haven't, Here's another flip with all the pages here. So cute, so adorable. Here's the center. I think the center is so pretty. So pretty. I'm working on two more right now, or three more. Again, look at, love it. 
love it so much it goes right well you can move them around wherever you want to that's just where i have them so but yeah such cute adorable pages my next one i'm doing this is another flip here she's drinking guys look my next one I'm doing, I'm doing it a little bit different. I'm gonna try it out a little bit different. Instead of one large compartment, my next one, big one is vintage. This one's bright and colorful, but my next one's vintage. And what I'm doing instead of one large one, I'm doing two. It's the same amount as the other one, but I'm doing two sections instead of one large one. I'm gonna see how it works out. If it works out and I like it, it was a little hard for me to piece it together. We'll see how it goes. If not, I'll go back to this. But yeah, such cute, adorable pages, honestly, in there. So, as I said, they're imperfect, but I like them to be as perfect as possible how I want them. You're beautiful. That's what it says, right? No, be yourself. <laughs> yeah, there's the back of it. Isn't that so cute? But I love all the little frillies. It's colorful, lots of, you know, decorations on it. And you get that little pen with it. As a little free gift you don't always get a pen but on my large junk journals i do try to send something a little bit with it and then on my smaller junk journals i try to send a bookmark so but here you go that's what it looks like it's so cute so adorable i just love all the multicolor and all the the tags have like for the bookmark have the little beads on them oh and here look here you got this You got one of these on there. You have one of these. There are the little tags here. Just some little extra things in there. And I keep these wrapped up in plastic bags so nothing happens to them. So cute and adorable, right? I actually use in my big, huge Timu bags to wrap them up in because these things are huge. Huge and adorable. But yeah. Wow, I just loved everything in my mail. I really think this is... Oh, oh, gee. Oh, that's his Tupperware. Look at here. It says Tupperware. I really think that's a, I don't know what that is. What do you guys think that is? Would you guess like I did? I think that's like, I don't know. I was thinking that's a good place to put your pills. What would you put in there? Coins, coins, pills. What would you put in here? That's Tupperware. I know Jerry does Tupperware. Check her out. Jerry, J-E-R-R-I, Fortune, F O. R-T-U-N-E, and I can say that because that's the name of her YouTube channel. Normally, I would not give out. I don't know if that's her real last name. I'm not going to say what it is or not, but I would do pills in there. That is so neat, and that's really good because it definitely would be waterproof, too. It's not box. <laughs> oh, buddy. So, I'm going to bring my thing back here. I'm going to have a couple more pieces of cake with you guys. Whoops. But first and foremost, I just want to thank everybody because you guys are just amazing. You are amazing. I love you guys so much, you know. I know. Isn't that neat? Check out, uh, get a hold of Jerry and ask her because she, I know she, I don't know if she still is, but I know, sorry guys. I know she was selling Tupperware and maybe she could let you know how you could get it because that's actually really nice because you could really store some stuff in there, especially when you're going on a trip or something. Hi, Minnie. I think that's actually neat. There's so many options you could do with it, but I would think a pill for myself. I love my froggy. I'm gonna set him up here too. I don't know if you can see him. Let's set him back here. There's my little froggy. <laughs> Thank you, Jillian. He's so cute. I'll turn him this way to see his eyeball staring at you. <laughs> he almost looks a little prehistoric there too, right? And when you do that on there, it makes me sound it makes it sound like that too. Oh, thank you, Virgo. Thank you so much. I was able to read that one. Thank you so much for sending that super chat. Yeah, I was able to read that one though, which is <laughs> Nikki's doing a lot better if you just heard her. She just came into the room. I'm having strawberry cake, celebrate my birthday with the most wonderful friends that I could ever ask for. And I said, when I started this channel, I never realized that I would meet so many wonderful and amazing people in my life, honestly. Who would think that you could meet such, I mean, I know there's such wonderful, amazing people out there, but I just never thought that we would have, because I think we have a wonderful community here. 
I think the community is just beautiful in our super fam. And I just never realized how great this would be, honestly, how I'd meet so many people. I mean, I feel so much love and support from all of you. Thank you, Angie. Angie, I'm not rushing you, but I just, I never got that, what you talked about in the mail the um, from the airplane, but it, which is okay, but I just didn't know if you sent it and it, it got lost or if you hadn't sent it, that's fine too. I just now thought about that. Oh, uh, thank you. Oh, uh, thank you guys. Thank you everybody. That is so sweet. I do, I feel blessed. I feel so blessed. Oh, thank you, Dominique. That's so sweet. You guys are amazing. You really, truly are. I know a lot of people did, you know, so much for me since I've been here. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> That's fine. I just was worried maybe it got lost. There's no rush because I don't have any big, you know, I told you that it's going to take me a while to figure things out. You know how I am. <laughs> but... No rush. I was just worried that you had sent that pamphlet and I never got it. My birthday is on Tuesday. Oh, Jessica, that's so sweet. That's so sweet. Mother's Day is coming up, guys. Mother's Day is coming up. I know what I'm going to get from Nikki. Some kisses. Oh, thank you. That's okay. Yeah, I just I just figured Sunday was probably better than Tuesday to do a little video. I do try once a year on my around my it's never maybe on my birthday, but around my birthday I have a piece of cake with you guys. I just don't remember if I did it last year. It was maybe the one year I maybe didn't do it. I'm almost thinking I probably didn't, but I'm not sure. So but uh I just like to celebrate with you guys because you're my family. So, and then that way we actually celebrate everybody's birthdays. I always have to tell everybody to bring something, enjoy me. You know, we'll just celebrate together. Everybody's special day is important. Oh, thank you, Miles. Hello, Lenovo. Le Lenovo. I know I always get your name wrong and I apologize. But yeah. Hey, Maria. I wish that we could have a million little pictures on here and we could all be on here chatting. <laughs> That'd be fun, wouldn't it? Everybody being able to chat on here. It'd be hard to hear each other, though, with all of us doing that. So that'd be interesting. One day it may happen, right? Sometimes I feel the year goes very fast and sometimes I feel it goes very slow. Oh, thank you. Yeah, that'd be nice to have a big party. We could all go on a cruise, party together, have fun. I've always said I'd love to do a meet and greet. I don't know if anybody would really show up there, but I'd love to do it. And you'd have to all tell me your screen names because I remember most of you by your screen name. <laughs> Many of you, I do know your first name, but I use the screen name because the chat goes very quick. You know, and sometimes, you know, I got to think about it because it takes me, but a lot of you, I do know your real name, but yeah. And then you say, okay, I'm such and such on YouTube. And I'm like, oh yeah, I remember chatting with you. Nikki's doing good, Sarah. Thank you so much. Oh. Yeah, name tags. Yeah, that's a good idea. You're right. Yeah, Superfly Cruise would be awesome. We could find one that's really cheap, you know, and go together. Oh. <laughs> I'd love to go on a cruise. I don't want to go by myself. Mm. Thank you, Lils. Thank you. I can't believe that, you know, we're all here. Nikki's doing good. 
It's a beautiful day outside. I took her out earlier to go potty and I was thinking, that's a nice little breeze. It was a nice little breeze going on. You think they can? That's what it looks like. It's just like a little mini cake. It's so cute, so yummy. Cruise and snooze. <laughs> Cruise and snooze with Christine. That's actually really good. Cruising and a snoozing. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that'd be really great. But that's funny. Cruising and a snoozing, yep. So, sorry. I have no idea what that is. Oh, that little stinker. You had this in your mouth. Don't look away. She had this in her mouth. It's wet. Oh. Happy early birthday, T. Martin. Thank you. Manny, thank you, Lenovo. Oh, I don't know anything about the gaming stuff, to be honest with you. I think the last virtual game I played was, um, well, actually, I, oh, thank you, Kelly. That is so sweet of you to send that super thanks. Thank you so much, or super chat. That's so sweet. Happy birthday. Thank you for sharing your cake with us. Oh, thank you, Lils. Thank you. Thank you guys for being here. It, it just touches my heart that you guys could be here with me. Enjoy your dinner. I hope you have a good dinner. Because <laughs> that little stinker, I knew she was chewing on something earlier, and right there it is. <laughs> I got to watch her like a hawk. You know what the problem is? Is she's on a uh, special food. She hates it. She'll eat it, sometimes, but she hates it. But then she'll search around for anything and start chewing on it. So now I gotta watch her for that too. But now I know what it was. And when I looked at her, she turned away, what? I look at her, she's like, what? She looks away out the window. <laughs> she's smart. She knows she's not supposed to do this. A little stinker. Anytime she does something wrong, that's what she does, what? What? What's over there? <laughs> But then I probably do that too, so maybe, no. <laughs> but yes, she does. Crazy little girl. She's such a stinker. And she knows when she's in trouble too. She'll like go down real low too. If she knows it's really bad or something. <sighs> Puts her nose in a corner. Oh, it's cute. But, well guys, I wanna thank you so much for sharing um, my cake with me. I'll say my birthday because this has been a special day to share it with you guys. You guys are what makes my day special. I know that for sure, as well as Nikki and everybody else. But you guys make me smile when I'm not feeling good and I come on here. I always smile with you guys. I really, I always do. I feel very blessed. I really, truly do. And I'm very thankful. I'm sorry, I got the hiccups now. <laughs> I'm very thankful for each and every one of you. I love you guys so much. I really, truly do. I say that, and but I mean it. I mean it that I love you guys so much. I really, truly do. It's going to be getting hotter and hotter outside. You'll probably be seeing some videos in my other room and some video from there. Oh, well, thank you, Crispy K. Thank you. And you'll probably be seeing maybe some videos from out here because it's a little cooler out here. So you might see a little mix, mix up there. Thank you, Leah. Oh, thank you, Angie. Thank you. Oh, you guys are so sweet. Thank you, Sarah. Thank you so much. My friend Dee, Dee talked about going and doing something next weekend. And I might, I told her it depends on how Nikki feels, which I think she's going to be fine. But I don't want to make plans and then, you know, have to say. But if I do that, I'm going to try to vlog that too. But I'm not going to tell you because I've never been there before. I might not be able to vlog. If they're blaring music, then I have trouble vlogging because you guys like to hear it. And if I have to take the sound out, then I got to put music in. But we'll see what happens. So, oh, I just did show Nikki. Oh, I did. She's over there resting now. I don't want to grab her. She's finally resting. So, but hey, guys, thank you so much for spending some time with me. I enjoyed my cake. I hope you enjoyed what you brought. I love you guys. Thank you, Jillian. Thank you, Jerry, for my beautiful gifts. I love them so much that you sent. 
I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day or a wonderful evening, depending on where you go, where you are, excuse me, not where you go, where you are. <laughs> I love you guys so much, and I'll definitely, definitely, definitely talk to you later. Bye-bye, guys.